What up Fortnite fam, I'm Matt, and the first update of Season 7 is here. From the Arena Hype reset to the brand new Cosmic Summer event, it's time to go over it all in under 5 minutes. Epic Games hasn't really given us much to go on in terms of Twitter patch notes this week, so let's just cover the basics of what we do know. It's two weeks after the beginning of the season, so everyone's arena points have now been reset. The competitive side of the game looks pretty different from pubs this season, with overpowered weapons like the Railgun, Recon Bolt, and even the UFOs completely absent from the mode. So have fun ranking up through the arena ranks on your journey to champs. If you want some help on that journey, or you just want to improve, you can click the link in the top right to be taken to ProGuides.com, where we have an army of pro coaches willing to help you become the best Fortnite player you can be as fast as possible. The Cosmic Summer event has begun, as with every summer since Fortnite has released, we have a bunch of new fun summer based challenges to work through, so have fun completing those, and hopefully Epic gets Believer Beach fixed pretty soon. Finally, the one thing that Epic did reveal, a surprise has descended in the form of the abductor ships, and there is now a way inside the giant mothership floating above the map. With all that said, let's go over the new map changes that Epic have added to the game this patch. From just glancing over the map, it doesn't look like much has been changed this patch, but don't let that fool you, because there have actually been some pretty cool changes. You can now go inside the mothership, where you'll be able to find locations from previous seasons that the aliens have abducted for further experimentation. The Butter Barn, Lucky Landing, and who knows what else can all be found in the cargo bay of the mothership. The ship also has numerous loot rooms with a wide variety of different rarity weapons inside of them. To gain higher rarities of weapons, you need to find these orbs while in the cargo room, but you only have a limited amount of time to do it. Don't worry competitive players, this little minigame is only available in pubs and not arenas or tournaments, so you aren't about to get blasted by a bunch of golden weapons in arena. Ok Fortnite fam, now it's time to dive deep into the Fortnite files so we can check out all the leaked cosmetics that have been added this patch. For the skins, we've got Scuba Crystals, Boardwalk Ruby, Beach Brutus, Beach Jewels, Human Bill, Nitro Jerry, Midsummer Midas, Incinerator Kuno, Roast Lord, Molten Ragnarok, Thanos, and finally Armored Batman Zero. Back blings are up next. There's the Duffel Dog, Translucent Tote, Plasmatic Gear, Birthstone Backplate, Scuba Satchel, Shelly, Brain Freeze, Ghost Skimboard, Fizzle, Feathered Flames, Tire Fire, Flaming Jewel Karma, Infinity Gauntlet, and the Exo Glider Cape. For the harvesting tools, there's the Hot Rod Ripper, Aqualug, Rainbow Carver, Gilded Shadow, Sparkle Axe, Sandy Shoveler, Marsh Mallets, and the Batarang Axe. As usual, only a few gliders. We've got the Boomer, Cloud Llama Board, and the Batman Exo Glider. Last but certainly not least, we've got the new weapon wraps. We've got the Glafika, Golden Black, Crystal Wings, Kabang, and Icy Pop. Of course, cosmetics aren't the only things that data miners have managed to scoop out of the files this patch, and there are various new items that seem to be heading to the island over the course of the next two weeks. First up, we've got the Inflatable. This is a suit that gives you cow-like properties, such as being able to roll down hills, bounce off cliffs, and oh, be impervious to fire. You know, just some normal cow stuff. Next is a brand new weapon, the Alien Knock Gun Launcher. Much like the Chimera Ray Gun, it looks like this weapon isn't going to do much damage to players straight up, but it will send your enemies flying away from you. There's also going to be a new grenade called the Alien Nanites, which will generate an alien biome in a large area for a short duration. We already know from the leaks in the last update that this cube is going to create an area of low gravity, allowing you to soar through the air. It looks like a new boss is on its way to the island. If you manage to defeat Zig and Choppy, you'll get their mythic Chimera Ray Gun, which will hopefully be just a little bit better than the original. Finally, it seems like the parasites and their eggs have finally been added to the files. Now that these are enabled, they will latch onto a player and grant them enhanced mobility, allowing them to jump farther and run faster. But at the same time, they will constantly sap health from you. Watch out when you go into bushes, because these little lads might be waiting for you inside. Let's keep the outro short and sweet, because this patch is pretty awesome. Like and subscribe for more Fortnite content in the future, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, <laughs>